Hello, you lovely creative people. Matthew here with Gear Sounds, and we've got a discontinued pedal. This is the first person that believed in Gear Sounds. Andrew from Mid Valley Effects. I don't have anything for you but an apology because this pedal was sent to me the first year that Gear Sounds started. Nobody believed in us, but Mid Valley Effects. They did believe in us. This is a monster of a fuzz. It's actually called the giant fuzz now. So if you like the sound of this super spitty, really gated fuzz, then you're really gonna like the sound of the giant fuzz. Because the giant fuzz is essentially the same pedal. It sounds like it's got more range and it also has more stuff in it. So Andrew of Mid Valley Effects makes these really nice overdrive fuzz pedals, distortion pedals. He's really come a long way in the past four years. I really suggest you check him out. I'm gonna leave his links in the description. He's got a YouTube channel, I'll leave that as well. I really like the sound of the gated fuzz. You can turn the volume down on the gain. Until it's so gated that nothing comes through. And that's kind of like a low battery kind of effect. The vol It's just essentially lowering the voltage. You can hear the real kind of. Interesting, the gate cuts it out. It sounds like almost like a synth. Let's go ahead and hear that clean tone for me. There's a clean tone. I'm using the reverb in the 65 Deluxe as always, set at about 4. Nice clean tone with the reverb. Add the delay in there, Bell Epoch Deluxe unit here, uh, CB3. is a very nice delay tone. Now the, uh, the Epoch Deluxe, it's like the Swiss army knife of delays. If you're into the tape delay style, I recently became into that style, so I really love this pedal. But if you're more into digital delays, the Bell Epoch Deluxe is definitely not for you. It's more of an analog, old school type of delay sound. I found this pairs really well with the fuzz. Let's get some more gain on there. Now what's interesting is if you use the volume knob, you can actually find the gate's point. So I turn my volume knob down to like six. And you can get that really kind of zipper kind of fuzz sound. Right? Great tone. Now if I turn the volume all the way up. Massive difference in the volumes here. The more voltage you put through this pedal, the less the gate chokes out the sound. So I can... I can get the gain all the way up. Once I start turning the volume down... I love that. I love that so much. You're essentially adjusting the sustain. The gate is attached to the sustain. He actually separates the gate out in the giant fuzz pedal that's new. So let's find the point of breakup right here. Awesome. All right, now let's get some nice recorded tones.
I will see you guys in the next video. Bye for now. And thank you again, Andrew. Hey, guys, it's Bob. I just want you to know, do not subscribe to this guy. Do not watch his videos. Definitely do not click on another video because he doesn't use a tube screen. He leaves me underneath the bed, guys. I'm under a bed. Before this video, I was in a bed. And he just took me out to take pictures of me just to humiliate me. Don't subscribe.